hi guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you how you can add multiple currencies on your shopify product page or checkout page now if you want to add like multiple currencies on shopify then this video is for you before we start i would highly appreciate if you can drop a like on this video and let's get started right now now first thing you need to do guys you want to log in into your shopify store okay uh, your Shopify dashboard. I'm going to log in right now and I'm going to show you guys exactly how you can add multiple uh, currencies inside your Shopify store. As you can see, guys, I'm going to go to one of my like my products. As you can see, if someone visits this product from uh, United States, they will see the US dollars, which is like the currency of the United States. Now, if they visit this exact product from another country, let's say that Europe, uh, Europe, they will see euro here as a currency, as their currency. Okay. Um, now, to add the like, multiple currencies to your Shopify store, first you will have to enable Shopify payments. Now, don't worry because I know everyone is not going to be able to use Shopify payments in their Shopify. But Shopify payments allows you guys to like have multiple currencies, especially on the pro on the on the checkout page. Because there are a lot of apps that allow you guys to add multiple currencies, but only customers will be able to see the currency on the product page. But when they click on 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 the ah uh, when they are in checkout page, they will only see the default currency you have set up for your Shopify store, which is the dollars or whatever currency. Um, now, if you if you cannot like um like enable Shopify payments then what you guys need to do is you want to click on settings at the very bottom left and then you want to click on apps and sales channels and then you want to click on shopify app store in the top right and then you want to search for currency converter and you want to download this app it's called Bax currency converter pro click on it uh because i already downloaded it i'm going to remove it and i'm going to show you guys how you can install the app from scratch and how you can set up the app okay how you can use the app okay so like i said this is the app click on install and you need to confirm you need to confirm the install like you just need to install like click click again on install and it will take you guys directly to the app okay so what you guys need to do now is to activate this app so that it can add like multiple currencies to your shopify store but keep in mind, this is only going to work on product page, okay? It will change the currency only on product page, but on checkout page, it cannot do that because like Shopify is not allowing any app guys to make any changes to the checkout page. I don't know why I have done some research about this, but I, have, I didn't find exactly the reason why Shopify like doesn't want to let any developer to make changes to the shop to the checkout page. Now here you want to click on get started and here you can set up money format click on setup and you want to click here it says uh, Shopify settings click on it go to Shopify settings click on it and then you want to click on these three little dots click on change currency formatting all right now after that you want to click on HTML with currency you want to copy the code under that and you want to paste it here html with currency and html without currency copy it and paste it here where it says html without currency click on save that's it all right now that's the first step is done click on next i have done this step here it says the next step it says enable theme app extension click on enable Okay, so now you want to go to theme app extension, click on it. And then you want to then enable this, okay? Toggle it on. Okay, so enable the app as you can see here. And then click on save. All right, now the next step here, it says enable app. You just click here on enable, okay, here. After you enable it, that's it. Okay, that's exactly, guys, how you can um yeah that's exactly how you can enable how you can enable this app inside your shop as you can see we have successfully 
uh, in a like uh, set up the settings here on the app as you can see now what you guys need to do now is to go to one of your products on Shopify I'm going to go to this product for example as you can see if someone visits this product from let's say United States they will be able to see her dollars but if they are visiting from let's say Europe they will see her currency which is uh, euro currency as you can see here okay so let me show you guys exactly as you can see this is now euro but if someone visits this from United States they will be is to be to be able to see dollars a Canadian dollars for example a British pound but this only works on product page like I said this doesn't work on the checkout page okay that's the only problem here I'm going to check on view on cart as you can see this works on cart also but on checkout page here it's not going to work okay as you can see now the currency here is going to be uh, the currency is going to be dollars on the checkout page but on cart page or product page you will be able to see the customer's currency okay so if this one guys helped you please drop a like and if you have any questions let me know in the comments i reply to every single comment by the way you can also customize this you can click on settings you can add as many currencies as you want here okay if you click here on settings you can add for example 150 currency new currencies here you can add as many as you want after you add all the currencies click on save um yeah that's it you can customize the, the design you can also customize the design display you can also like make some changes to display like the position here advanced if you click on advanced you can change the background color text color um multiple things here now if this video guys help you please drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you need any help let me know in the comments i reply to every single comment see you guys next video for good